And in addition to these all-stars, let me also thank the 150 NBA legends who've been in town for the last week working throughout the community. Thank you very much to all of them. And without further ado, the winner of this year's MVP trophy is, of course, Anthony Davis from New, Year New Orleans Pelicans. You know, A.D., I, I guess this shouldn't come as a huge shock because the night that you were named a starter, you were on our show, and you just came out and said, I want to be the MVP of that game. Yeah, um, it was a lot of fun. Uh, my teammates did a great job of looking for me. They just told me, you know, set a pick and down to the bats, we're going to throw it to you. So it was a lot of fun playing with these guys. When did you start thinking, and were you, were you aware of what the record was for points in an all-star game? coming into this that Wilt had 42 and when did you start thinking about that tonight? No, when I came out in the third quarter and I had 32, I told the guy I wanted to get 50 and uh, I think Russell Westbrook had told me the record was 42 so I just started playing, getting lobbed and then at the end, it was just the emphasis on trying to get 50, which is very fun. Tell me about the significance finally of being able to pull this off in the place that we are tonight here in New Orleans in front of the home fans. Oh, it was amazing. That's what I wanted to do it for, for the city of New Orleans and the Pelicans organization. You know, I love this city. And these guys support us each and every night. And so I wanted to get this one for them. There's never been a night like it in all-star history. 52 points. The MVP, Anthony, congratulations. Thank you. And let's go back to Mark. All right, thank you, Ernie Anthony Davis of the New Orleans Pelicans, considered to be the host here, and uh, comes through with the MVP award, an all-star game record. Here are some more of the all-star records. <laughs> Set. Just keep tonight. going. Keep talking.